Sorry. Tell them the Ellen story. Yeah, I moved to Nashville from St. Louis. My house burned down. Uh, moved to Nashville not knowing a single person. I met this kid the month I moved there. We put a video together, and literally two weeks after that, we were on the Ellen Show. Mm. Changed my life. I got to meet everybody in Nashville, and some people liked me, some people didn't. Mm. And then I met Tim and Byron, and uh, the next day after I met them, we were cutting records in the studio, which was pretty cool. Really? Yes. One day later? Yeah, literally the next day, and his band played on every song on my record, which is mm. probably my favorite thing about the whole experience so far, because those guys are just freak freak of nature, talented. Yeah. You still call them the damn tall doctors? I know he I fired think he calls the them like the tall. revamped damn yeah. tall doctors. Yeah, I don't yeah. even know if they like being called that anymore. But he fired most of them, didn't he? Oh, yeah. I think, I think there's only kept, one guy left. He kept the band leader. Okay. Yeah, the band leader. And he kept the drummer, I think. Well, he's got like three different drummers now. But. Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, uh, four songs on my album. When we were in the studio cutting records, we thought we had all the songs done. I wrote all of them. Tim pulls out this this like stack of CDs with my name on top of them. And he's like, these are all songs that were on hold for me that I was thinking about for you. I ended up cutting every single song, and they were all on hold for Tim. And this is one of them. This is called Name on It. <laughs> Town Main Street, who's around the courthouse just out messing around. When a blind haired gray man heaven in a CJ7 with the top pulled down. I pulled up, shown up, there's a new kid in town. Yeah, I was thinking about leaving, but now I believe we're gonna see her right here. Breaking up the new who's leaving, let her peek in the rear view. Oh, 